Welcome to Reality Creative Video. I'm Hermes, and here we go. Gotta ask you, have you seen the movie Limitless yet? Have you? Ah, here we go. Let's become limitless. If you're wondering how I do all of the things that I do in my day, it's because of colloidal gold. It truly makes you limitless in what you can accomplish. All right. Now, with that out of the way, I am going to uh, bring you up to date on how our experiments are doing. If you watched the previous video, I introduced you to my experiments this week. So I figured, let's do a recap on it, okay? All right. So first, um, remember the stainless steel question? What happens if you put a colloidal in a stainless steel container? Well, it's been sitting in this container for, I don't know, since the last video, at least two days. And hold on a second, I'm getting the stuff. What I put in there was colloidal fence. So all the colloidals are, are in here, at least the ones that I make. So in the beginning, I'll show you the pictures, okay, on the from the video scope over there, if you can see it. Um, that is the current picture. I'll show you up there. Um, of there's the before and the after. Before we started the experiment and after we poured it in there and then I put it in the scope in the video scope to see if there's a difference. As I expected, absolutely no difference whatsoever. So feel free to take your colloidal, put them in stainless steel containers or metal containers, put them on spoons, whatever you want, and it uh, didn't it doesn't phase the colloidals. I mean, I'm going to keep the experiment going for a week, but if you don't hear from me in the video or otherwise, this experiment I'm considering closed. I want to again thank all of you for stopping by, and I am so glad that we're able to chat like this.